New tonight, how long will you have to wait to get a COVID-19 vaccination? Even if vaccines are approved soon, the distribution process may move too slowly for some. The state's top health officials have always said that vaccines won't be instantly available for everyone. Now it sounds like the general public may not be able to get vaccinated until next summer, at least here in Texas. 12 News reporter Victoria DeLeon is live with the breakdown. Yeah, Jordan and Dej, well, a limited number of vaccines could be available within the next two months, but essential workers like those working in the hospitals will be prioritized once a safe and effective vaccine is available. It's the question we all want answered. A vaccine will be available. Um, you know, and we're planning for that eventuality. Despite Texas Department of State Health Services spokesperson Chris Van Dusen says a vaccine could be widely available by the middle of 2021. In a virtual public meeting Monday, other state officials offered a possible timeline for vaccine distributions, but they continue to reiterate that nothing is set in stone. As you can imagine, we are in a very fluid situation with new information about vaccine development. Imelda Garcia with DSHS says essential workers would be prioritized during phase one, which could begin in the next two months. Phase two is set for the most vulnerable to the virus. Phase three opens it up to the public. That's scheduled for any time between July and October 2021. And during phase four, if there's a sufficient supply, you should be able to go to your health care provider of choice. We know it's a long time to wait. And here's another big takeaway. Of the six companies working on vaccines, most require two doses, all with different time frames. And so this will definitely complicate our vaccine distribution and allocation um, because you not only have to know which brand that individual got, but also the timing and when to bring them back. Garcia says the storage and handling of the various vaccines also presents a challenge. Doctors' offices and clinics will have to agree to storage and handling guidelines. And then we can make sure that we allocate the right kind of vaccine to those individuals or to those clinics. So while we are closer to answers, there are still a lot of questions. State officials don't know exactly when or how many vaccines will be available. It's something we'll continue to monitor and update you as we learn more. Live in Beaumont, Victoria DeLeon, 12 News.